Okay, let me resume. Anyone else getting deja vu? It all looks the same with this fog. Well, it don't sound the same. It's them jelly things from Seknar. That explains Stumpy's cousin. No, it's Novacore. I hear voices. How can you not tell the difference between monsters and people? It's not that. We're clearly hearing different things. It's definitely those jellies from Seknar. If I can hear their spiky things shooting out. What do you know? Rocket strikes! Hey, that was right too. Sums it up. At least there's a way out now, I guess. Okay, now that's them bouncing eyeballs from the QC. No question. I'm not doing this. Something is clearly messing with us. Shatari? Okay, well, that's just wrong. You're worse than her. Those overgrown lizards make clicky sounds. You got moss in your ears. I'm with Groot. It's Shatari. I'll never forget those things as long as I live. got something to do with the freaky fog. Every time you name an enemy, it has the power to make that enemy appear. So the key all along was to keep quiet? Yeah, like that. It's not done with us yet, Guardians. Yeah, well, let's just keep our eyes open and our mouths shut for now. The fog entity has retreated for now. There's no immediate risk. Yeah, no offense, bug lady, but nothing you say means anything anymore. So the fog is an entity now? Yes! Sort of. Obviously, if some fog monster's trying to kill us, it means we're getting closer to whatever it is we're looking for. That kind of makes sense. And if this fog monster can make bad things appear, maybe the opposite is true. Like, if we all say cure Drax, maybe that's what we've been looking for the whole time. I wish, Star Guy. But no. The one time she gives a definite answer. Drax and the whole galaxy. 
easy. Let me get back to you. Tough to see what happens next, Gregory. I only know that if we succeed in helping Rimini, we stand a chance. The cosmic energies will realign and a new series of possibilities will emerge. That sounds confusing. Definitely. Okay, okay. Look, guys, um, <clears throat> I appreciate what you all did for me back there with the water thing, um, but following the bug lady any deeper is officially stupid. Rocket. No. Fog monsters? Cave pigs? Wet waterfalls? Technically, all water... No, no, Quill. She doesn't know where we are. She doesn't know where we're going. She doesn't know what we're looking for! Mantis, are we hot or cold? Room temperature. Okay, okay. This is crazy. She is probably crazy. It's not about her. It's about us. I am super proud of us. Because we've never gone this far for anything before. Oh, this is the one where you inspire them. Just think about who we were when we started. Um... Well, you were a two-bit broke pirate who couldn't even outrun a tree. Exactly. And you were a two-bit bounty hunter. Just as broke as me. Just as depraved, self-centered, mindlessly chasing every unit, bar, contract, bank to rob. I still like many of those things. So do I. But none of those things are why we're here now. Right? You're down here kicking ass for Drax. Not Drax the Destroyer, not Drax the Rampaging Criminal. Drax, man! You've gone to the ends of the galaxy to hunt people, to hurt people, to get revenge in what I can only assume are some excruciatingly painful ways. But doesn't this feel kind of good? Going this far to help someone you care about? Oh, it feels so good. And Groot. Uh, he says you don't have to. No, no, I do. Because we all need to learn something from you, man. You never complain, but, or if you do, I don't catch it, but I, I, I'm pretty sure you probably definitely don't. You're always there for us, and that's what this is about. Us, growing together as a team, following a crazy lady into a death cave because one of us needs help. Because we are a team. Help, we're a family. We're the fucking guardians of the galaxy. Yay! Really great speech, Quill.
Not dead. <laughs> I can't believe you did that for us. Hey, a friend needed help. Bunch of them. Rocket, man. Yeah. Can we please just save Drax already? us to jump in the hole. I may not know what we're looking for, but I know it's down there. Okay, let's finish this, because I sure as flock didn't get all wet for nothing. down here. If it can bring us back our grumpy Catastrian, I'm all in. And the rest of you should be too. Come on, guys. We're the freaking guardians of the galaxy. Um, is that supposed to be me? I heard you make that speech so many times, and then Gamora says something like, we're going to need Drax? We're here. Home of the healing light. Source of the cure. Origin of Raker's power. It's a cocoon? Told you she was gonna feed us to some giant bug. Or maybe she's the bug, and that's some kind of external digestion sack or something. <laughs> you realize this is weird, right? Oh, it gets weirder. What the... Oh, gross! 
Please tell me Drax is the only one who's got to go in that creepy egg sack. So the shepherds found fresh flock. the gravity of your treacherous trespass. You cannot quell a god. Prepare for oblivion, interloper. It's this one. Okay, Green Meanie, you're up. <sighs> Found you. What wayward wickedness is this? Nasty uglies from that busted noggin of yours. Wait, Aiden Warsock. Ashley Warsaw? Adam Warlock? That's it! The Golden God guy! Hold on. This guy's Raker's old divine whatever? Looks pretty good for a dead guy. Were you not sent by the sanctimonious shepherd? Us? With Raker? Not a chance. We're trying to shut his ass down. See? Friends. Okay, big guy. And we go. Come on! All the ones where we die already happened. Oh. <sighs> Raker's got half the galaxy going cuckoo bananas. Her friend included. I swapped your ass for a newer, younger, blue-skinned model. So... Can you help us? Mantis seems to think you can cure Drax. My heavenly healing is veiled malignance. A first folly I swore never to repeat. Ugh, can someone translate this guy? He said no. What protection I can proffer is to remain reclusive. Not this time, Goldie. The pieces need to go back together. We just gotta get you all closer to the puzzle. And that would be... In here, of course. Let, let's talk about the... What the butt? It's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. Welcome to the Astral Plane, Snorlord. You teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your minds. Merged our what? I gave no consent to this planescaper. She's not big on asking permission. It's all pretty sure this and fate of the galaxy that. Don't you get huffy, god guy. Your gold hands are all over this mess. What's that supposed to mean? I thought this guy was how we cure Drax. Cure and cause can coalesce. Uh, guys? Is that Drax? <laughs> So we're going into Drax's head. Literally. Green Meanie's in there somewhere. Find him. Convince him to come back to reality. Uh, Mantis, please tell me we're supposed to be going into the bright light. Pretty sure. You need to reach the heart of Drax's promise. Much deeper than I've ever seen. Wait, if you've never seen it, does that mean it never happens? Hope not. Just keep going. And if we lose contact, Listen to Amy Winsaw. She means you. Quite clearly. Whoa. This is Drax's promise? Mine was a lot less downery. This is just a doorstep. Poor guy 
was stuck here, reliving the loss of his family. Your friend's fear and pain primed him as prey. There's the big galoot. That was easy. This is just an... Uh, I'm not the only one that hears that, right? <laughs> Drax? Not Drax. Thanos. Bet you weren't expecting a family reunion, eh, Gamora? I enjoy this. Whoa. Okay. After all, something's not right. You fail to fathom the rules of this realm. <laughs> what the? Okay, that's new. That's new, right? I think I'd remember there being two of them. Twice the ugly, twice the target rats. <laughs> <laughs> Danger! My fault it! Hey, Goldie! Don't support you want to lend a hand! Fight a phantom! Fear given four! I think we did something, but I don't see Drax. Oh, good. Not creepy at all. Hold up. Look. I bet I could beat you to the center. <laughs> Not so fast, little one. Drax, wait up! something doesn't want us to reach Drax. <laughs> Maybe Drax doesn't want us to reach Drax. There he is again! Drax, buddy! Wait up! Forced to follow fools. <laughs> wait a minute. I can hear you. You play Paul on a board built by your opponent. You got a better idea? I'm all ears. Oh, assuming we ever catch 
to. What then? I'm working on that. Left. Huh? You can see me. Friend is too far fallen to be willed back by words. For someone who's been no help, you seem full of opinions on how this works. Hey, how did you beat me? Force me to follow this fantasy impossible. Because I am your father. Playing in your mother's garden again. I was hunting. Hunting dirt? No, I chased it, but it was too quick. Only fools rush forward. A hunter waits, chooses her moment. Drax. <clears throat> Papa, are you all right? Drax, Camaria, it is time to come home. What the flock is that? Yes, little one. Mother waits. Insidious succubus! Release your thrall! It's not in Kansas anymore. Flark are those! Spawn of shadow! Snuff their source while I widen our They're way! They're coming from those nests! keeping us from Drax. You saw simply its spawn. That black stuff. Is that? Drax's wife. I think so. Hovat. Then this must be Drax's home. <laughs> you two certainly took your time. Only fools rush. Let us go inside. Drax, buddy. Your words are wasted, Wynn. Easy, all right. I got this. Come on, big guy. I know you can hear me. Why do you haunt me? We're gonna lose him again. It's me, buddy. Stormlord, remember? We're all here. You're stronger than this, Drax. Come on, you big luck. Don't leave me alone with Quill. Drax, dinner is ready. That's not Hovat. You gotta let her go. You do not know what you ask. Fire this time. Just like last time. Make haste. The mom means to snap shut. I cannot contain it. We're working on it, man. Working on it. Let's do it! Or not! Ah, time for the 
endless entropy. Cease this charade! Cover your eye holes! Maybe it's not all bad. I don't see any new promise, at least. We are an empty eternal echo. Naked nothingness. Not helping. Hobo wizard. All right, everyone just split up and look for a way out. Or forward, or whatever. I lose a bet if I die in a dark pit. It was alone in a dark pit. Drax! Come on, buddy. I know you can hear me. This ain't flarkin' funny. I know you're in a dark place right now. Literally. But we're not gonna give up. Just point us in the right to- There, look. I can't believe that worked. Let's go. Part of him is still with us, I'm sure of it. I hope you've got one hell of a speech plan, Peter. That makes two of us. doing this. Do not leave me be. You gotta trust us, Drax. We're trying to help. By destroying my home. Your blissful ignorance is an ignoble pursuit. Easy, Shakespeare. We got this. Come on. You don't really want to stay in this dark hole? I would endure the depths of Sarduth to be with my family. Drax, love. It is time to eat. I get it, man. They seem really special. They are the only thing that matters. I hold that. The most fearless mate I've ever known. She brought me peace even during times of war. My Camarion. My innocent little Camarion. She was the best of us both. Despite her meager stature, they both were. were. family is gone. What sits before me? I don't know. But it's not real. And it ain't good. It is a perversion. Fed by desperation. Without it, I will have nothing. I cannot be alone again. You're not alone, man. We're here for you. We've all lost someone, Drax. But it gets easier if you surround yourself with the right people. I'm Groot. Uh, Groot said some mushy stuff. Let's just pretend I said it too. Cherish the time that we had, and not resent the time that we lost. <gasps> Shall love 
and honor you both. Always. sound mind, thanks to you all. I owe amends for my lapse in judgment. Hey, you don't owe us squat. Ain't none of us perfect. It's kind of our thing. <laughs> How much do you remember? Great darkness grew with every lie that I swallowed. The longer I remained with my family, the more certain I became that I could never leave. You quill. Your child is in danger. If her pain is half of my own, the darkness may consume her entirely. Not if I can help it. We gotta be smart about this. There's a whole lot of converted between us and her. A whole lot of that black dwarf, too. And anyone wanna tell me why Harry Hobo was able to suck it up? More than why that thing looked like him. Because it is me. Together, and Smart Money says it's gonna be a tough fight. Even in earnest, you underestimate. So, anything you can tell us about what we're up against will be a plus. We're all on the same team. We've gotta work together. I am in favor of this plan. Goldie Braun seems capable, despite his ridiculous name. <sighs> Very well. Attend my tale, for its folly cannot occur. Let's see, okay. Come on, Quill. Ain't we spent enough time in this dastard cave? Right. I hear you. Ran. This place. A bit long. I'm gonna wrap it up here and I will resume in the next one as usual. Peace.